And here is a live look at Harry Reid from our Sunset Camera. The holiday weekend is expected to set records for the TSA. 17 million people were expected to fly between Friday and today. AAA named Las Vegas as one of the top destinations this year. So a lot of flyers made their way through Harry Reid over the past few days. A big driver of tourists to the city this weekend, both USC and LSU football fans who attended the showdown at Allegiant Stadium yesterday. By the end of this evening, just this Labor Day alone, 108,000 people will have flown out of Las Vegas. Every month this summer, in fact, the airport says it continues to break travel records. To keep up with the demand, the airport's pressing ahead with its supplemental airport expansion. But in the short term, Southwest Airlines says it needs more flights and bigger jets. Really, really busy. A lot of people. It seems like it moves along at a fairly respectable pace. From tourists to locals, demand for flights at Harry Reid International keeps surging and reaching records well past 57 million flyers a year. By 2030, numbers will surge past 63 million a year, and that's when the airport will hit capacity. The FAA points out there are challenges to meet the demand even now. People look at the sky, it looks like open skies. There's not a lot of ways to get the planes into your airport system. We need as an airport system to be able to meet the demands of the next 75 years. The airport's major solution is coming by 2037 with its Southern Nevada Supplemental Airport by Jean, offering 6,000 acres of space for commercial carriers. Right now, the landlocked airport has to maximize 2,800 acres and its runways. Major Airlines Southwest says it has 260 flights in and out of Harry Reid daily and keeps adding more routes. To keep up with the demand, Southwest says it has a strategy to use bigger planes. One of their aircrafts has 143 seats. The other has 175 seats. A company spokesperson tells me using a larger plane on a higher demand route like Las Vegas gives customers more options to get here. What also brings in more travelers? Each special event. Southwest says it added even more New Orleans flights for the weekend's USC and LSU game at Allegiant. It's adding more red-eye flights to the East Coast and may even add an international destination out of LAS. Every time I'm here, I have a great time and I hate I'm leaving. Well, I hope it keeps coming, keeps us green. As for the next steps for the supplemental airport, it's still in the environmental assessment phase. In June, county commissioners approved a contractor to complete the study. The study will be finished in two years. Protest